big day is finally here. Sailors arrive at Port Everglades to board 70,000 tons of metal. 2018, the original, the world's biggest heavy metal cruise. The Pool Girls, the international ambassadors of metal, are ready to welcome you on board. Sailors came from no less than an impressive 75 different countries around the globe. Time to check out your stateroom before meeting on the top deck for a drink. The crew is busy loading 70,000 tons worth of equipment for four live stages on board, including the pool deck stage, the world's biggest open air stage structure to sail the open seas. While the ship takes on extra beer for thirsty sailors. <laughs> Latin American sailors organize a meeting called La Esquina de la Enye, the corner of the end. New friends are acquainted and the party gets going. I'm Yvette from Mexico. My name is Moises Osorte. I'm from Honduras, man. Hi, my name is Marcelo. I'm from Argentina. Hi, I'm Carlos from Panama. Jade from Colombia. My name is Raul. Irma. We are from Mexico. Hi, my name is Alejandra. I'm from Argentina, too. Maria from Colombia. La Esquina de la Eña is the place presenting uh, Latin America here. Yeah! Viva la Eña! Uh, we are so excited to be here. Craziest party that you ever can be. Five days without any sleep. But we are so fucking happy to be here. Uh, it's a dream come true. <laughs> See you guys in the mosh pit. 70,000 tons of TV, yeah! yeah. While the crew sets up the stages, there's time for lunch at the Windjammer, an endless buffet with 70,000 tons of food. Make sure to grab a last drink before heading to the muster drill. All cruisers and musicians must report to their stations. As the ship sets sail for the Caribbean, the first towers of the pool deck stage are erected. As soon as we reach international waters, shows begin in the inside venues. What is a metal festival without fine dining? Make new friends from around the world and share a meal together in the formal a la carte dining rooms. The bar is open and you can forget the tuxedo. Dress code is metal. At the other end of the ship, destruction is ripping apart Studio B. Crews work through the night to build the world's biggest open-air stage structure to sail the open seas, as shows continue till early morning. Sailors try their luck in the ship's onboard casino, which carries a social atmosphere and is a good place to meet new people. Swallow the Sun treat fans to a special set, playing Songs of the North Part 1. They will play all three chapters of their latest opus, becoming the first band ever to play three times on board 70,000 tons of metal. Late Night Pizza is always available at Sorrento's for a quick fuel up between shows. When late at night becomes early in the morning, naps are acceptable. Make sure to share and subscribe to 70,000tons.tv and tune in for our next recap of day two.